So we're going to turn this to this. So first of all, I have done this thing. I added something. I'm going to get rid of this. Uh, I will uh, delete this thing. So first of all, uh, select your object. In this case, the monkey. And uh, we're gonna go to particles here, okay? Here, particles, and click, uh, click plus. And here, you're gonna choose hair instead of emitter. Choose hair. You're gonna see something like this, okay? And after that, what are you gonna do is we're gonna change this hair length to about 0 0.1, maybe. Okay, yeah, this looks good. And then uh, we can change just this number from 1000 to maybe, uh, let's say, 30,000. Uh, we'll need more, I guess. 50,000. Okay. Right now, uh, the monkey is black and the hair is also black, so um, we want to change the color of the hair. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go here on material. We already have this, but I'm going to do it uh, once again. So what you need to do is click on this plus sign and then click on new and we're gonna change this new material its name to hair and then we're gonna choose this base color white by default it's white uh, anyway so we're gonna keep it white I'm gonna go to the particles once again and I'm gonna go down here uh, which says render okay here render and here material is material 001 click here and we're going to change it to hair so now the hair is white so this is almost ready but the thing is uh, it's covering all of its face the whole head we don't want it, uh, want its hair i mean we don't we don't want the monkey's face covered with the uh, hair only its uh, head uh, not the face so um, let's go to from this object mode we're gonna go to weight paint okay so if you see there you can see blue and uh, red so the thing is uh, the red part is where you're gonna have hair and the blue part is where you are not going to have hair. Uh, so for now, first of all, we're gonna uh, turn off this particle, okay? This something like television, TV, this sign. Click here and as you can see, we have this hair, um, red and blue. I already did this before that's why the red is red part is there on its head by default it will be like uh, this like blue okay so what you need to do is you're gonna just click like this and then it's gonna turn to a red you're gonna choose this strength so one strength is the full strength if you decrease this to like 50% and then you click here you're gonna have like the part where we you will have less hair not completely empty but less okay so I'm gonna put it back to one okay you can uh, uh, increase and decrease the size of the brush uh, by pressing on the bracket after the P um, the key P key on the keyboard the letter P okay. right beside P you will have 
opening bracket and closing bracket you know to adjust the size of the brush you just do like this okay and yeah I think that's enough so now the red part will be covered with uh, um, hair but the blue part will not if you turn this on particle system it still has this you know hair cover on its face uh, because we need to do something here uh, when we do this weight paint if you go down here data you will have this group so by default then it's kind of it only says group uh, like if you click on plus it says group right so uh, by default it's just group we can rename it as hair group so that we know it is the one so after we have these various groups renamed you uh, we can go back to this uh, particles and then down here uh, um, where, where it is let me see um modifier uh, uh, uh let me see maybe i missed something let's go here hair shape filled with oh there's something yeah vertex scripts if you go down here vertex scripts and uh, the first one is density if you click here you will see the group here so hair group click on hair group now you can see the hair is only on its head you know on the back not at the front not on its face if you go back to object mode now you can see you don't have uh, hair on its face there are some there, it's just that we missed some of the a very tiny little part when we did the weight paint. Otherwise, it's all good. If you turn this uh, overlay off, you'll see this clear picture. Okay. Uh, we can actually try go to weight paint and try to remove the hair from here uh weight paint is that okay let's see uh texture paint and if you go to weight paint okay press control okay If you press Ctrl and click, it will paint blue instead of red. Okay. Let's come back to layout and yeah, the the center part, center one, is gone. We still have some there, but it's okay. So this is how it looks. Okay. So yeah, this is how you uh, make hair grow on just certain parts of certain parts of uh, of an object. Okay. So I hope you like the video. Uh, if you like the video, don't forget to hit the like button, leave a comment, and do not forget to subscribe to this channel.